Firstly, insert the software CD of Da Qin 3D Mobile Beauty Master version 2015 to the computer, and then right-click to open it from the removable storage device. This file, Da Qin A158 B168 drive, contains the driver of the cutter. It's necessary for the cutter installation process. The file drivers contains the driver of the soft dog. The file name start with KFSE is the upgrade package. The series of numbers behind the KFSE is the same with the numbers on the soft dog. There are two necessary files used for installation. There are the Da Qin 3D Mobile Beauty Master version 2015. And the personalized font software. Double click. Next, next. The default installation location is local disk D. Click next. Click yes. And then it will auto create the directory. And then start. It takes about a few minutes for the installation process. Just be patient a little bit. Installation completed. Click next, and then exit. Now let's install the personalized font software. Right-click on the mouse and select Run as Administrator. Click next, 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 and then it's okay. Back to the desktop, we can see the icons of the software we just installed: the Da Qin 3D Mobile Beauty Master version 2015, and the personalized font software. Next, let's install the driver of the soft dog. Firstly, open the cover of the soft dog. Insert it to the computer. Once it plugged in, it will automatically detect the new hardware, and then install it automatically. On the right corner of the desktop, it will appear a prompt: "Automatic installation." If installation failed, Open the disk and find the file of driver. And then double-click the red and blue icon to start the next installation process. Click next. Next. And then it's okay. Firstly, insert the software CD of printer driver to the computer, and then right-click to open it from the removable storage device. Click Epson Setup. Click Custom Installs. Click Printer Driver. Click Accept. Click OK. Click Menu to select a port, and then click OK.
click OK, and then exit. Well, next, let's install the driver of the cutter. Firstly, connect the power cable. The socket of the power is on the left of the cutter. After connect the power cable, let's take a look at the USB cable. One end is connected with the computer, the other end is connected with the cutter. After connect the two lines, let's put the software CD of the Daqing 3D Mobile Beauty Master version 2015 to the computer. And then turn on the cutter. Once the cutter is turned on, the computer will automatically detect the new hardware and then it will install it automatically. And then it will prompt a successful installation message. After successfully installed, we click the start on the computer, find the devices and printers. Here we can see the cutter we just installed. Next, let's install the cutter and show you how to operate it. This is a blade and a blade holder. The blade is inside the holder. Push the end, the blade will appear on the top. If you want to replace the blade, push the end like this and then the blade can be taken out. And then you can replace a new blade. When replace a new blade, you need to push the end and then insert the blade. Once the blade is automatically absorbed, loosen the end. Now the blade is successfully installed and then we adjust the length out of the cover. Firstly, we unscrew the tighten screw. And then adjust the adjust screw below. Now we can see the blade is out of the cover for just a little bit, say about 0.2 mm. After adjusting completed, let's tighten the tighten screw. And then put it on the cutter. Kindly note that now the cutter is turned on. Now we unscrew the screw on the cutter. And then put the blade and blade holder inside it. The blade and blade holder will automatically get stuck. At last, let's tighten this screw to fix them. Now, the blade and blade holder is successfully installed on the cutter. After installed the blade and blade holder, let's have a look at the control buttons on the cutter. They are the power button, pause button, and the reset button. The F minus F plus is for adjusting the force of cutting. The V minus V plus is for adjusting the speed of cutting. When you want to cut stickers, firstly find the sheet of sticker like this, and then put it into the cutter. On the back of the cutter, there is a pressure hold levers, lowering the pressure rollers. the two white pinch rollers will raise up. Now we put the sheet of sticker inside the cutter. Kindly note that the two white pinch rollers on the left and right should both under the sheet of sticker. Please look carefully, there is a guideline here. You can arrange the sheet of sticker 
to the correct position according to this guideline. Now we can ensure the sheet of sticker is horizontally positioned, and then we can see that both of the white pinch rollers are above the sheet of sticker. Well, now we raise the pressure hold levers. At the same time, the sheet of sticker is fixed. After we fixed the sheet of sticker, now let's take a look at these buttons. Just now, we've already introduced their functions. For cutting the stickers, adjust the V button to the third light from the left. For the adjustment of the F button, it depends on the thickness of the cutting material, and the length of the blade extends out. For example. We adjust the force to two lights, or we can start from one light and then see whether this level of force can cut through the sticker. After adjusting the cutting speed and cutting force, now let's press the pause button to turn on the pause light. Once the pause light is on, the function of the V minus, V plus, F minus, F plus changed. Now the V minus V plus becomes adjusting. Move the sheet of sticker back and front. F plus becomes an order of testing. The cutter will automatically cut a five-pointed star. When cutting finished, take the sheet of sticker out. And then tear off the five-pointed star. Check whether we can tear it off completely. If it can be cut through just right, like this, and the backing paper is not cut through, like this, that's just right. If the cutting force is not big enough, and then it will not be able to cut through the sticker. In this case, we have to add one light of the force. And continue testing. 